definitely going to be seeing that chance for some stronger thunderstorms in the area, all thanks to this real big weather maker we've been tracking all afternoon long. Well, we have upper level energy, and that's what's going to help provide us with that chance for some of those stronger storms to develop through those overnight time hours and into the day tomorrow. Again, we have the system. It's going to be progressing off to the east to plenty of instability and also known as Cape convective available potential energy. So we're tapping into moisture. We're tapping into Cape. We're tapping in to that heat, the daytime heating. That's what's going to spark up some more of those stronger thunderstorms across the northeast all the way down into the Ohio River Valley. As we head into our Sunday time period, the yellow shaded area indicates a level two out of five, meaning scattered strong to severe thunderstorms is likely what we're going to be anticipating. Wind is going to be the primary threat. However, isolated tornadoes not out of the forecast, especially in the brown shaded area in the northern tier of New England. That's the case across portions of New York as well. So we're going to be keeping a very close eye on this, continuing to see those stronger thunderstorms really flare up and amplify into our afternoon by late afternoon. Multiple strong, even severe thunderstorms will be anticipated as the system continues to progress to the east through those overnight time hours. Still a couple of stronger thunderstorms going to be possible, but really headed into our Monday afternoon time period. Again, a little bit of the same story here. We're going to be anticipating more of those stronger thunderstorms to really blossom and amplify across New England, stretching down into West Virginia and Virginia during the afternoon through the evening hours. Why we have another slight risk across the mid-Atlantic into the southern half of New England continuing into our Monday time period. So you want to make sure you're staying weather aware and a little bit of news here. It's going to be cooling us off just a little bit this frontal system across the northeast. So at least there's a bright side to it, but just make sure you're staying safe with that severe weather.